Hey everyone, Matt Pisarsik from RazorEmporium.com coming at you today for a quick product spotlight looking at the brand new Razor Emporium Lavender and Menthol. Well, it seems like just yesterday, but it was actually almost, what, seven years ago? Ugh, gosh, time flies. That we started making in-house made shaving soap and affiliated products. The first thing we did when we came out with these was we had four signature scents. We had a sandalwood, a barber shop, a citrus, and lavender. And truth be told, my original kind of thought process with the in-house made products was kind of classics and, you know, cover the bases. If someone walks in, I can point to it. It's a good value brand good good quality stuff right well the lavender went pretty well but it wasn't the most popular in fact within a year or two I think we discontinued it it didn't last very long it just didn't sell very well I think there's first off other other lavenders on the market and I don't think ours really stood out so we kind of thought about bringing it back but if we're gonna bring it back we're gonna try to make it better and by making it better this time around, we have added a little bit of menthol and a little bit of rosemary. These two other notes, I think, really help to balance out the big, bright lavender smell. And they also, especially when you're using it, you can feel that little cooling sensation with the menthol. And that rosemary gives it like another kind of note just to not make it be so one-dimensional. Gives a little bit of depth to it, a little bit of balance, kind of an earthy note to it. And uh, they work really well. We've showed a lot of people coming through the lobby, kind of the prototype, and we've had it now for a couple days on the site. It's already been selling. We're hearing some great feedback. So I thought we'd make a quick video. But not only is it the shaving soap, of course, but we also always want to bring the other associated products, the aftershave balm, the aftershave splash, and the beard care products, the beard balm, beard oil, so that if you are a lavender fan, you can dive right in and use the entire line of products. I did a shave with it recently and I was very impressed with it. It, it performed really good because it's the same Razor Emporium vegan base, but it just has this really nice new note. And uh, truth be told, I love, I love something that has a bright note like the lavender with the cooling effect. It's kind of like, it's the reason why other brands like let's say Parasso has the classic, the green tube of Parasso, right? It has a eucalyptus and menthol and that menthol really balances it out. So that's kind of the inspiration of trying to, Add something else in there to balance out the big bright lavender smell because not everyone wants just that bright smell only. But great performing product, uh, great smell. If you haven't done so, check it out. Maybe it can grace the shelves of your shaving den next. That's all I got. This is just a quick FYI product spotlight looking at the brand new lavender and menthol soap from Razor and Porn. That's all I got. Check it out. If you have any questions, leave them below in the comments. Any suggestions for other soaps we should be making? I want to hear from you guys. And we will see you next time at Razor and Porn for all things vintage shaving. Thanks, guys.